Dirt Track, Fabulous Hudson Hornet, and Jet Robinson. So I guess now it is time to get on to the review. There is obviously the bump on the name the bump on the name tag because it is made in Thailand. There they are. It has the red cars logo over a vast majority of the package with the art of Dirt Track Doc and Jet Robinson. Or Dirt Track Fabulous has the Hornet. Dirt Track Doc is Doc with the red red wheels, which I am still missing. On the back there is Heyday Smokey. Leroy Hemming, Duke Coulters, and Heyday River Scott. I am missing these two still. Case J did not hit my area. So yeah. I guess now it is time to get these two out of the box. Anyways, let's get on with the review of these two. I will start with Doc because he is probably the least excited and I've saved the best for last. Um, he has this chrome front grill. I was going to say front bumper, but it's just the entire grill, grill area that's chrome. He has the little uh, Hudson Hornet logo and the hood ornament. His headlights, the eyes, twin H power, Hudson Hornet 51, the back window. There is all of that nice dirt decaling and the old Piston Cup logo, dirt track tires, the Hornet logo, fabulous Hudson Hornet with the Hornet in yellow. 51, more dirt on the fender. Hornet, Hornet, and there's Hudson with the taillights and a chrome back bumper. This side is the exact same, except it has the addition of a mirror. And here is the base. So yeah, really chromey. No face reveals today though. I will compare him with the original Mattel Dirt Track Dock, or not the original Mattel, the original China Dirt Track Dock after I finish. Going over Jet Robinson, he has this really nice kind of grill mustache there and a silver with this gray front bumper, his headlights, a stripe on the hood, and a rocket that says it make way. Jet in quotations and Robinson. Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. I think that's how it's pronounced. I'm not sure. Number 17. Southern Gold High Test Yaseline. With number 17 right there. This side is the exact same. And on the back there is 17. Southern Gold High Test Gasoline. And a license plate which is a bit odd. Doc does not have a license plate. And it is... Let me read that. B0925P and some other stuff there. Maybe the camera will focus. I don't know. I'm focus. There you go. You kind of can see it. And here is the base. So, yeah. This guy, um, Jet Robinson, is actually the car that Herb Kerbler is portraying in the Thomas Moore race. So that's really cool. Um, they are basically the exact same design. Except Herb has the spoiler and two Southern Gold logos. Because of course the spoiler is there. And oh, the, the wheels. Yeah, he just has these gray gray rims not that exciting and doc is 
This was his first release to be piloted, though now you can most likely go into a Walmart or Target store and find just the regular Doc Hudson made in Thailand on the Blue Desert series, which is that one that Jen Tansadan is on. Yeah, this is the regular Hudson Hornet. This is the Dirt Track one. Both are made in China. Honestly, I think I prefer this one just because like this is just that with a bit poor decals. This is an original one though, I think. I'm not really sure because I don't know. I don't have any Thailand made cars except for Roland Bowling Mater from the original ones. So I'm not sure what Yuri's from. But I honestly prefer this stock over this one. Because and I'm sure a lot of people do. But it really, and for me, it's the dirt decals. It's the way that the dirt is. Because if you look closely, these two have different dirt decals. I like this one. I'm not sure. This one's growing on me. But this one, I'm not really sure. This one is a lot more realistic. I do, I do think I like this one better. But... Other than that, it's probably this one, because, I don't know, this one's eyes look a lot more like Dot. These are a lot smaller. And there's, like, that blue outline, you can kind of see. I don't know, it just pops more than this one. I'm not really sure, though. Tell me in the comments which one of these two is your favorite. I'm gonna have to go with Tyler. Okay. A little bit of technical difficulties there, but yeah, we're back. My phone just fell off the stand that I used to set it on, so yeah, no biggie. But anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching this review on Dirt Track Doc Hudson, or Dirt Track Fabulous Hudson Hornet, and Jet Robinson, and I will see you all in my next review. Bye!